begin transmission! This is Gaiagush and I with more Pokemon Yellow! In the last part, we did a lot of stuff on the SSN, and today we're going to finish that up. And it'll probably be the rest of the video, hopefully. Hopefully it won't take me too... It won't be too short, because I want to start the gym in the next video. But this guy's going to be pretty nice. He's going to actually show us that Pokemon that was blocking our way back in Route 12, which is a Snorlax. We will not get Snorlax until a little bit later, so... Yeah, put it out of your mind for now. But for now, we're going to fight some more trainers, because there are a lot of trainers. Fisherman! He has Goldeen! Tentacool! And another Goldeen! And he's dead! Fainted. Why is he saying dead? I don't know. Dead sounds better. So yeah, Goldeen's. Uh, the only cautious part about those things is that they know Peck, but Peck isn't very powerful, but especially since it's water type, so it doesn't have the type advantage that it normally would. Alright, so we got another gentleman. He has a Voltorb. And a Magnemite! We're gonna be seeing a lot of those in our future, I believe. Ah, good fight. I feel young again. You... You know, you want to feel young again? Go put on a few 50 layers of anti-aging cream. Ha <laughs> ha, you're old. Anyways, in this room... A lot of the rooms in this, uh, hall actually have no trainers. Like, probably half the rooms here are probably just random people. Uh, that guy's kind of giving a hint about another upcoming HM move. Uh, this should be a trainer room, I think. Yep, there we go. And this should be a gentleman. What do I like? A strong or a rare Pokemon? Can I choose both? You didn't specify. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, Growly! Ponyta! Oh wait, I've never fought a Ponyta yet. Ponytas are fire types, and they are also very fast Pokemon too. Um, I believe uh, Chugga was the one that said they're pretty much the fastest fire types out there or whatever. Uh, at least first gen they are. <laughs> But yeah, yay, Gravel leveled up! And if you're wondering why I'm so low in HP, blame that Voltorb I fought earlier because it had Sonic Boom, the idiot. Yeah. Anyways, now that that's done with, let's deal with this last, I think. I never saw you at the party. What the hell? Is the, where is the party? I, I, I was promised a party on this cruise ship, dang it. Haha, <laughs> yeah, Julie Pop, I need a Reno. Okay, that's dealt with, and this item is a rare candy! Yay. I don't know if I've ever talked about rare candies yet. Um, they're a very useful Pokemon item that allows you to uh, uh, to level up your Pokemon instantaneously. So, if like one Pokemon is like, like one level away from evolving, like a Magikarp that's level 19, you can give it a rare candy, and BOOM! Gyarados! So yeah, and yeah, these last two rooms are nothing. There's just no one there, so I guess the way is clear, and now we can finally get HM for cut. Or cut, I don't know how. Ah, oh, crap! Oh, sure, Ga uh, Gaia. I haven't seen you here. Gaia, were you really invited? Tell your poker it's coming. I've already caught 40 kinds, pal. Different kinds are everywhere. All around grassy areas. What are you, Professor Oak? What the hell? He goes from pleasant conversation to battling again. What the hell is wrong with this guy? Anyways, his party is pretty much unchanged from the last time we fought him. His levels haven't progressed that much either, which is really weird. Because my level 25 Pikachu just nuked his bureau. Now it's a level 26 Pikachu. But yeah, his levels have virtually not changed. Oh my god, Thunderbolt! Oh man. Nice move. Okay, uh, Slam. I don't like Slam. Like I said, it's, um, accuracy makes it kind of a bad move sometimes. Plus, it's Thunderbolt. Hell, I mean, and I know, Thunder Wave, why do I have Thunder Wave? Because I like paralyzing Pokemon. Shut up. And then Double Team is useful because of the evasion factor. Anyways, his Rattata, which is a pitiful level 16. Seriously, Gary, did you even level up your Pokemon at all? Seems like that. It's dead already. DOA. Now he's gonna use Sandshrew. Uh, okay, we got uh, Gloom. We finally have a Pokemon that's super effective against this guy, huh? Ah, <laughs> uh, he's got a bit of a scratch on him. Well, let's take care of that. 
Ah, oh, dang it. I almost O-code his third Pokemon. He used Slash, a more powerful form of Scratch, but he, he's dead nonetheless. Critical hit! <laughs> this game loves to throw out critical hits when you're killing a Pokemon. Or fainting. Oh god. Screw political correctness. I hate political correctness. It, it can go suck a dumb. Uh, wiener. Anyways, Eevee, his last Pokemon, is his most powerful Pokemon too. Level 20. It's still no threat at all. As Xenarena will prove. Die. Uh, it looked like it hang out to dear life like that Onyx did that one battle. <laughs> Guys, beat <it> Gary. <laughs> At least you're raising your Pokemon. Yeah, can't say the same for you, loser. I heard there was a Cutmaster on board, but he's just a seasick old man. But Cut itself is really useful. You should go see him. Smell ya. What do I? What do I smell like? I hope it's hot dogs. Anyways. The goal! We've made it! We've made it! This is the captain! Roark, I hear the idiots! Urgh, seasick! Guy rubbed the captain's back- HOLY CRAP! I'M A SEXUAL PREDATOR! Woo! Thank you! I feel much better! You wanna see my cut me? I could show you if I wasn't ill! I know you can have this! Teach to your Pokémon you can see can cut anytime! We get HMO1! And no jingle, for some reason. Alright, now that I'm sick and more, I guess it's time. Okay. Mm, I'm gonna... Ugh, shouldn't have that. <laughs> yeah, I'm silly. Anyways, um, he gives us uh, the first HM of the game. HMs are like TMs, only they can never break. You can use them infinite, uh, infinitely. Uh, the catch, though, with HM moves is that they can never be de deleted. Like, if your Pokemon learns a new move, you can't replace, um, it, you know, you can't, you know, replace an HM move. So, we're walking away victorious from uh, SSN. Keep in mind, the second you leave this place, though, so, uh, well, you'll see in a minute. But basically, like I said, the, the captain was the goal of this place, and now that we've dealt with the captain... SSN finally goes on its merry way. Too bad we couldn't take a cruise, it would've been nice. I mean, all we did was just fight a bunch of bored trainers in a dock. Pretty lame, huh? <laughs> and now keep in mind that once the SS land leaves, you can never go back to the docks. So, not that it matters. I mean, that truck Mew thing was disproven several times over. So, yep, so say goodbye to Ver Vermilion Harbor. And I guess I'll end the video here. Like I said, I want to start the gym in the next video. So, this is Gyrocushion 9. Let's play Pokemon Yellow. In the next part, I will take on the third gym of Kanto. So, see you later, guys.